Hi, I'm Scott Destasio, and today I want to talk about what is nursing home or assisted living facility abuse and neglect. They're really two different things. Abuse is actual intent, whereas neglect is just simply not doing the things you should be doing. So let's talk about abuse first. There's three general categories. There's verbal abuse, there's physical abuse, and then there's sexual abuse. Verbal abuse are things like talking demeaningly to your loved one, belittling them, or simply calling them names. Unfortunately, these things do happen with staff members. Physical abuse can be rough handling of a loved one or actually physically purposefully harming them by beating them. And then sexual abuse. It occurs in two fashions. The first is a staff member sexually abusing a loved one and the second is other residents that have uh, maybe dementia and sexually abuse your loved one. So these are things to look for. Now let's talk a little bit about neglect. It's different from abuse in the standpoint of abuse is more an intentional doing of something. Neglect is, is simply not getting to the things that needed to be done. They, Kurt, we've got all that noise going, is that? Yeah, these trucks are annoying right now. Well, that's why the, um, uh -huh. that curtain, that's why it's closed. That's why it's there. It's a noise dampening. Yeah, the light works perfect though. I, look, I, I, <laughs> I know. All right, let's try it again. No, you might no. Get a couple of like LED stands to put around it just to light up the room and keep them closed all the time. It's I have, I have them. Okay. If you want to pull them out, I just don't know if they'll do the room. It's it's a lot of setup. Yeah. They're old style. They're umbrella, and they have um, bulbs in them in the umbrella, a bunch of bulbs, and their gotcha. models about this big, and their stands, I have two of them. Okay, we can pull them out later, another time. I mean, <sighs> th they shouldn't be too bad since the mic is focused under your chin. Yeah, it was just, all right, all right, so all right. where are we? Back to starting with, now Next, you're on yeah. to the way. Okay. Next, let's talk about neglect. It's different from abuse and then abuse is more of an intentional doing of something, whereas neglect is not doing the things you should be doing. Now, neglect usually comes from two different things. First, facilities are often understaffed, so they don't have enough staff to get to the things they should do. And second is indifference. Now, most nursing home employees and assisted living employees are angels. They're the kind of people that just want to help other people. But over time, they can become indifferent to the care and needs of loved ones because they just see it so often that they don't get to the things they should be do doing. Typical types of neglect are your loved one needs help eating. And they don't help your loved one eat. And so they end up eating less and not getting the nutrition they need. Providing your loved one with fluid, it seems like a very simple thing. They fill a basin with water and your loved one can get it whenever they want. But in reality, many times people with dementia don't think to grab the cup that's next to them, don't have the ability to pour water into the cup. And so the employee should be actually offering that fluid and they don't. Next is they're not bathing them. Unfortunately, in most nursing homes, the time schedule is just to bathe a couple of times a week. And so your loved one can end up not having good hygiene. The next category of neglect is not turning and repositioning them. As we get older, our skin becomes more sensitive. We can't provide as much um, blood to the areas of the skin. And when we lay in one place for too long, that can develop what's called a pressure sore or what other people call a bed sore. And so what these facilities are supposed to do is come in every couple of hours and turn and reposition so you're not in one place for too long and cause those types of injuries. And a definite type of neglect is not getting to that. Uh, next is um, not getting your loved ones up out of bed. 
It sounds simple, but they need help often to get out of bed. And if the if the facility staff is doesn't have time or they're indifferent, your loved one lays in bed instead of getting up and getting out with their day, enjoying the activities of the facility. So these are the types of things to look for for neglect in a nursing home. I'm Scott Distasio from Distasio Law Firm.